That's crazy hydrophobics. Yeah, so I just wanted to add a little ditty on the end of this video, guys. I don't know, I can't remember exactly what I've said about this product in other videos, although I've said it's good. I really rate this wax, the Gion wax. Why do I rate it? Because I think it goes on nice and it comes off really nice. It buffs beautifully. Really good wax to work with and apply. The applicator's quite clever and it's extremely hydrophobic on application. It makes the car look good. I haven't had any secondary cure issues and it feels nice. You know, the wax, the surface of the car feels nice with the wax on. I've got the, I know I've polished it as well. So it's how much of that is freshly polished paint versus the wax, but overall I'm happy with my results. I've already done the dirty work on this, you know, the review stuff that you can get a cheaper wax if you like. You know, if you're on a budget, there's waxes that are less than 30 quid and you'll get more wax for your money. So, uh, and there's waxes that last longer, you know, this don't, don't last as long as Fuso and, or even built Hamber double speed. So if you're, you know, if you like that, if you want all that less, more performance for less money, then go and buy those waxes. If you've got a wax that you like, stick with it. We always have to put those caveats in, but this is a very very good product for me i'm really looking forward to using it more and the ceramic detailer is the little icing on the cake you know what's the difference between the ceramic detailer and their normal detailer because that's pretty decent there's their normal one uh well this one's got ceramic material in it the main thing is it'll be a bit slicker now some of you'll be saying well this is all a con job this is all a con job it doesn't the, the thing is it doesn't cost any more or any less i think they're virtually the same price to tell me in the comments but i think this is nine quid and i think that is as well so um for you to try the ceramic detail over the normal one won't cost you any more and that's kind of takes away the cynicism that might exist around ceramic you know ceramic sprays well i think the problem is with that cynicism is the products are popular because people like them not because they say ceramic. That's that's from me quizzing people on it. Um, so yeah, this Gion stuff is good. It's, my, it's like my little <laughs> my little fine reserve cabinet. I've got the Gion wet coat. I've got the ceramic detailer and the quick detail. I suppose that's kind of a bit more obsoleted now. I don't know. It's still a good product. Uh, and I've got all these other ones as well. They, these are these are keepers. They're too good to not have, they're too good. I almost want them out on display and have like a little shelf here with a blue light and all these bottles. Look at this. Just looks so damn good. 
it's the only brand that when you run out of product you'll go and fill it back up with some colored water just so you can look at the bottle no all right yeah yeah see so you're, you're all screaming now you won't do that john this is just crazy um yeah big fan of this brand you got your you know i'm a i'm a cheapskate i'm not a cheapskate i'm not a cheapskate i pay the money you know when i can but there's a limit isn't there because everything's expensive so i'm like building stuff up as i go along getting all the good stuff like getting these now look at this these are coming soon they're coming soon i'm on it i'm on the case of imran i'm on his case to get it sorted it's everything slow at the moment with covid and all that so you know um but going back to the cheap cheap skate you know forensic steve's telling cheap skate i have all my bulk chemicals in here that do 99 percent of my car cleaning stuff i've got some di water touchless surfex hd some citrus fallout remover ipa the built hamber qd that i'm going to mix down so this little bottle is going to make me five liters worth of qd at nine to one is that a liter in there no, it's 500 mil, okay. Yeah, so that's right. Yeah, it'll make me five litres. And at nine to one, you just mist it on. You can mist it on and towel dry your car. I've done little videos on that. Um, and it's great. You Or you can dry, dry spray it. Spray it on and buff it. It works at nine to one. It's very diluted down, but it still works. Um, and you don't get any streaking with it at that concentration. What aren't you getting though, John? Because you've just been telling us about the Gion Ceramic Detailer. You're not getting that. That real ultra bling, that slickness, you know, and that feeling <laughs> where you're using the Gion bottle, that's what you're that's what it's missing, you know, because I'll have this loaded up into a bottle of this. But you know, you're talking about minuscule differences, aren't you? Um so 99% of the time, you know, I've got a QD that I can use that doesn't cost me anything. Um I shouldn't be I always put myself in the mindset that I don't have a detailing channel because the cost is really irrelevant to me because there's so much product that's coming through the channel. I've always got, like, these cupboards are full up. <laughs> and these cupboards in here are full up. And I've always got an endless supply of random things. But I like to lay it down in my head and get my sort of, like, product line up, concreted in my head. Um... And I'm pretty much there with that at the moment. I'll do another video on that soon if you've been if you've been asking. John, can you go through all your products you use from start to finish? Um, I will do that, maybe tomorrow. Um, that's it, guys. So just done a very quick wash on the car just to keep it. Um, it was bugging me that it had a bit of dust on it. <laughs> that's another curse of when the car's polished. You always want to keep it that way, don't you? So... Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you soon on the uh, Forensics Detailing channel. Six minutes of me waffling. <laughs> Good to see you guys. Take care as always.